So um, one of the partnerships that we have, um, we, had, we called the Ryan Project. And the Ryan Project was working through Children's Hospital, and Ryan was um, a child that during the 2008 hurricane winds that came through, he unfortunately got hit by a tree branch and had traumatic brain injury. Um, as a result of his injuries, he had some symptoms that were much like a stroke, and so he couldn't open and close his left hand. So what we did was we had an interdisciplinary design charrette um, where we spent the weekend and we, and we, had, we involved Ryan and, and then several kids from the local community to come in and through play we tried to experience exactly what Ryan's challenges were. So Ryan's challenges, we played Nerf Wars with him so that we could see how he would move his hand um, and, and just what all of his challenges were to identify then take that into some product concepts that could help him. So we were looking at what therapeutic products would help him understand the moving his thumb because that's one of his challenges that he had. Um, and then, so what could he use for therapy? And then what could we use for assistive devices that we would then go ahead and create? It was a wonderful weekend. We had biomedical engineering students and design students put together, kind of holed up into a room, which was a, cult a wonderful cultural exp experience for them because design students will stay up all night and engineering students like to go to bed. And so it ended up being an, an all-nighter. They built functional prototypes and the next day they presented them. So um, getting out and, and having the students experience somebody's the empathy for somebody else's situation and then try to solve those problems while learning how to capitalize on their own disciplines um, and then interact between them to solve those problems, fantastic experience.